My bad, you guys. <laughs> the mic was muted. But anyway, yeah. Money grinding tips on GT Sport. Not just not just Blue Moon Bay, but there are other events on this game that you guys can do besides this. You got this. You got one, two, three, four, five, and six. And plus, you can finish th these races. One, two, one and two are long, but all these. They're worth the money and I recommend that you do it two times each because it's the more the money the more the better right so yeah if you guys want more tips and tricks or anything like that comment down or send me a message on what's another car any car that you could use for any of these well this is restricted and that's restricted but anyway let's just get to it so blue moon bay I'm just gonna do this two times each any car, don't worry about all these, but any car that's under N600 or lower, I just start, usually I use the Mercedes SLS AMG or the 458, but I'm going to use the Mercedes for my 89th win, and then I'll use the 458 for my 90th win. I'm going to, I'm going to remind the others. But yeah, so, oh yeah, and anytime you do Blue Moon Bay, make sure that the LaFerrari isn't in first, e even if you're in a lower car like the RX500 or the Alpine, but I recommend a lower car, or an N600 car. Oh yeah, and make sure that you have your transmission set to 230 on a N6, any car that's higher, detune it to at least 639 or 630 horsepower so the first class beginning I'm in the SLS AMG 2010 version oh, shit, oh, shit. yeah this car is heavy and I lowered the weight that's not good I lowered the weight on this thing what is the problem but let's not worry about that what's really important is doing these races for you guys and helping y'all get as much money as possible All right, now I'm in 14th place. Make sure you keep it clean. Even if a car slows down, make sure you brake as fast as possible because you don't want to hit that car. Because if you hit that car, that'll, that'll also count. Shut the fuck. That'll also count as a car handicap bonus. And oh my God, it's just got dark outside. Is it about to rain or something? Cause I just, I'm looking outside, it just got dark. But yeah, we're on the second lap now. Keep it clean as possible, you don't want to hit anything or hit the walls. Keep your line straight, keep it stable, and you should be fine. I was gonna count that one, um, Formula One race with the Gran Turismo Formula 1, but I said, nah, there's not that many people like that event, and plus it's gonna get boring. But I'll, I'll think about it, if I want to throw it in there for this tip or not. 
Look at this NSX. This car is always winding up in the bag. This car is always winding up in the bag. It's always the it's always the NSX or is it always the Jaguar that winds up in the bag. It's always those two cars that wind up in the bag. Like legit. Alright, we're coming up on the bike room. We started at 142, and it looks like we might finish the race like around 150, or probably 153. Hang on. Yeah. Fifth lap so far I'm keeping my lines tight. Making sure I stay in a good lane. Yeah, the La Ferrari I mean any car can keep up with that, even D2. Like I used the GT40 Mark 1 even without the Blue Moon Bay tune and I still kept up with it. And the Veyron. It wasn't as easy, but I did my thing. Ooh. Okay, okay, okay. Take your time, take your time, take your time. Okay, I'm right behind the... Now I'm with the Benino now. Jeez, that Benino is fast. <laughs> Look how fast it's going fast, that V8 Vantage. Oh my god. Alright, and now we're behind the Legends. The Enzo and the F1. Yeah, you can also use the Enzo. You, you can also use the Enzo as well. But make sure it's detuned, I would say like 630. Pretty much the same horsepower. The Lexus is stay gonna get left behind. I have it, um, I just don't use it. Look at that clean pass without hitting that. Look at that, a clean pass without hitting the end zone. And now I'm right behind the F1. Yeah, this stream's gonna be long, but trust me, you guys will take me later. And plus, I'll probably make like 10 or 15 million. I mean, that's the goal. I'm trying to get one of the most expensive cars. One of them. I know I'm not gonna make it to the Jaguar. I could, I probably can, but just as long as I save up, I'll be fine. I don't really care about the visions that much. Oh yeah, and also, um, Monday I got summer school, which I'm gonna hate because I failed one test. One test that I have to go to tutorial for, it's not even summer school, I didn't fail all my classes. I passed all my classes. It's just for one test, ooh, that was close. But anyway, yeah, just for one test. One test that I could have passed. So now I have to go to the tutorial for this Monday through Thursday. Hi. Monday. It was plain. But, but yeah, um, yeah, I gotta go to summer school. This Monday coming up. Monday through Thursday, at least there's no school Friday, which I'm happy about that. 
Ooh. All right, we got five more laps to go. I'm right behind the Citroen. Right behind the NSX and the Porsche. I got a stink shot fast. I got a stink shot fast. Cause I, I don't I don't really have an advantage. I mean I have an advantage, but then there's a disadvantage. I wish the 250 GTO could go on this. That would have been an interesting car for Blue Moon. But unfortunately, it's a GRX, which, oh my god, and I hit the wall. Wow. That's, that's what's hard. But I don't care, but yeah. But yeah, the 250 GTO, that could have been an interesting car for Blue Moon. Like, that'll be the car to test for Blue Moon, I know for a fact. If I get the handicap, we're doing it again. But not in this car. There's still other cars I have to test. And I'm right behind my brother. I'm catching up to him. Jeez, how fast are you going? The La Ferrari can handle it too, but I recommend I recommend do not put it to N700 because you're gonna get a you're gonna have a hard time. Yeah, you're gonna have a hard time. You're gonna have a hard time with the LaFerrari being an N700. But, N600 will help, or N500. The 177, it's decent. But, with the transmission set, I recommend you set the top speed to like 242. Yeah, that's the sound of the jets up there. I swear, that Viper, I think it's fast on here. But it can't even pass the 650S. Like, it'll get close and then the 650S will start pulling on the street. Like, legit, in a straight line. Like, it'll just start pulling. I did a drag race, but pretty much all of them maxed out to 249. But the McLaren can go up to 280. The McLaren actually killed the Viper. Going straight down. Like the Viper was keeping up. But straight down the hill, the Viper got killed. And a drag race between the Mercedes and the 458. Eh, it'll be a close one. But then again, the 458 could go to N900. But this could go to N800. F1 and the Enzo, they could go to N900. The Nino can go to N1000. Pretty much, the cars that you see in 5th, 6th, 7th, and 8th, they're also N900. Hurricane, you might want to move. That's sad, the Hurricane's not even that fast. And the Viper passed the 12 seat. Eve then looks like your car looks like your car got. Here, let me give you let me give you a helping hand. Come on, you stupid idiot. Thank you. You see, we finished the race in like a good 10 minutes. It's 153. That Viper almost got me. That Viper almost got me. And we finished it. Let's go. That's my 89th win. Right there. Please tell me that I not get the handicap. If I got the handicap, I'm doing it again. Yup, we're doing it again. But not with this car. We're doing it again. 
I knew if I wanted to hit that wall, I would have been okay. But I hit the wall like an idiot. I'm going in the F40. So now we got to do 91 now. This game's great. If I wanted to hit that wall, so now this is gonna now this now this grinding tips are gonna take longer than I thought now. There's another F40, and there's a Veyron, and now the Viper's in A. So now we got two Mercedes, two BMWs, one Lexus, and one Aston. Alright, this is how I have my F40 set up. But I'd rather keep it, like, right here, for Christ's sakes. Alright, let's go. This is gonna take, this is gonna take longer now, because I hit the wall. But the, I think the F40 can do better. Hey, look. Comparison. Um, compare this one with the one in the Crew 2 and the one in Horizon 4, but not the original, not the original Horizon 4 F40, the Lego version. Maybe this one is probably faster. Or that's just not making any sense. I love Ferrari, don't get me wrong. Ferrari's been my manufacturer. Ever since Test Drive Ferrari Racing Legends back on the PS3, that game's a classic. The, oh, the one Ferrari that stood out to me the most was the F50. And to this day, the F50 is still my number one favorite car. My second favorite is the 250 GTO. The F40, I would say that's number five. The 330, the 330 P4, that's like my third favorite. And my fourth favorite, not gonna lie, the Enzo. And RF the Enzo, I wish he still a lot of this thing. Ferrari's still good to this day. I don't care what nobody says. I mean, I know there's other men, I, I know that's. I know there's other manufacturers out there that's doing good, like Lambo for example, Lamborghini's doing okay out there, McLaren, pretty much all companies are doing good, but some companies are dying. Okay, this is actually fast, this is actually fast, okay. That's the sound of the Jets again. And the Veyron. Oh, yeah. That was actually... You know, if you guys didn't know, and this was a rivalry. The Enzo Ferrari and the Veyron... I just said that so dry. The Enzo Ferrari and the Bugatti Veyron, the 2013 version. But I think it was the 2010 version that... But anyway, like, they were both rivalries back then. Because... When I was out with my grandparents out in, cause you know, if you, if you guys didn't know, they're out in Cali as well. Yeah, they're out in California as well. They flew all the way out here for the 4th of July just to see us. I was happy to see them. But, they, they showed me a picture from my old ship from a drag race that they saw with the Enzo, with both the Enzo and the Veyron, and surprisingly, the Enzo won. 
but this is the thing though, the Bugatti gets the it gets the acceleration off the line and the top speed, but somehow that Ferrari pulled a little bit after it hit the sixth gear. Once it hit the sixth gear, it was pulling. And then I asked them what happened to the what happened to the Veyron during the race. They didn't have no reason. They didn't have anything to say. All I know all I know from what they told me was that once it finished, like the suspension rate was not as sufficient. So that's how I know there was something wrong with the Veyron. Even though the car's a hippo and it's fucking heavy. Trust me, it's easy. Out of all the games, this is the easiest. This is the easiest game to money grind on. The crew two is also easy, but only coast to coast. Let's be real here. I mean, you can do other events, but coast to coast is like the main. Ooh, that was close. But yeah, coast to coast is one of the main events that everybody money grinds on. Um, paycheck. There's a money glitch that's still going around. Um, Solar Sprint, that's still going around. But, I don't do that. The one drag race at the bottom of the map, by the gas station, I just do that back to back. Like, in that game right now, I'm sitting at 1.7. Yeah, like, I'm sitting at 1.7 million on payback. And on 2015, Need for Speed, I, I think I'm sitting at, like, 600 and 28k I think on the, on the first crew I got like 550 something I do platinum freeze I, I, mean, I jump on the game every once in a while but then I just drive around for fun sometimes I just mess around go on a cop car chase somebody in a crate people are still bad on the first crew if you guys didn't know and I forgot to do the 4th of July stream I, ever since that I had my grandparents on me I got easy to shot this. But I do have 4th of July pictures though. What game has the better sound in F40? Damn. Um. If you compare, okay, I'm going to have to throw all these games in. If you compare the 1 and 5, Gran Turismo 5, Gran Turismo 6, this, the first crew and the second crew, Drive Club and a few forces. Yeah, a few forces, I said it. Um, damn, that's a tough one. Because in the crew one, it sounds more like it sounds like more. It sounds like it has a little bit of a V10 in it. That's the way how I see it. I don't know how you guys see it, but it sounds more like a V10 if you actually. But um, in this game, I will have to I will have to give it like a one. But it actually does have the better sounding, and it actually sounds correct. I don't know how the second, the second crew also sounds like it has a, it sounds like it has a V6, and the crew kind of, it kind of does. And Forza, okay, Horizon 4, it's, it's a tie between this and Horizon, in my opinion, but I know you guys have y'all different opinions from different perspectives, which I respect. I know half of you guys know a lot more than me. The drag coefficient on this thing is just amazing. If we're talking drag coefficients, we're going by the spoilers.
him already? I'm right behind it. Oh my god. The race hasn't even finished and I'm already right behind the Viper and the McLaren. I'm gonna hit 200. You could do this race two or three times. Any car, any supercar or lower car, but it gotta be detuned. No, it cannot be an N600. Um, no, it cannot be an N700 or an N800. Cause you're gonna have harder. You're gonna have a harder time. Even if you're an N1000, yeah, you're gonna get a hundred thousand if you're in an N1000 car. If you know how to handle it, you'll probably get like 120 or 110 thousand. It just sounds so good, and it looks so beautiful. In, in my opinion, all Ferraris look good in red. I just like the color red. And yes, I'm playing on the controller. I have a wheel. I do have a wheel set up, but I just don't use it that much. Logitech. I still gotta do a few fixes on my thrust master. Yeah, got, I have a good I might post it on Instagram later today. And my Instagram name is DF underscore speedster. DF underscore speedster. Okay, this is a motion. First it is raining and now the sun is coming back out. What is this? What is this weather? What is this weather? What is this weather? What is this weather? I don't get this shit. It was just not raining and the, the sun just came back. I don't know this weather anymore. I swear, is that the Veyron right? I please tell me that's the Veyron all the way up there. Or am I right behind it? No, that's the F type. Is that the Veyron? Please tell me that's the Veyron right there. Oh yeah, that's the Veyron. I gotta laugh that thing. Come on. It's probably gonna get me on top of the I got, I got that. That Veyron was too late. <laughs> 90 is win. That's my 90 is win. Wow. See what I tell you. 285,000. And now we're at 2 million. Yeah, two times. Well, we gotta do it one more time. Because I got a handicap. We gotta do it one more time. Bef we're gonna do it one more time before we go to the GR2. So 91 win. I have so many. Um, do I want to? Yeah, we're we'll going to F1. Yeah, last car. If we get 285,000 again, then we move on to the GR2. But it's two times. It's two times each. Yes, I know the races are long, but trust me, it's the worth. I mean, it's not as long as the endurance race. Trust me, if it was the endurance race, I would have threw that in. Hang on, give me another minute, cause I thought I told this one. So we got the Venino, we got the Enzo, and the F40. Damn. Why they do that? They always put the Mac they always put the MP4 in seven. What happened to it being in six and fifth? Well, at least the Viper's in nine. So we got two Lexus, LC500, two and four, one Mercedes, and one. Damn, I just went past them.
Alright, make sure that it's right here, 639. 249, 230 at least. It don't need to be that fast, but it's already fast. It sounds better. It, in my opinion, it sounds better in 5. Even though 5 and 6 have both the same sounds, but in my opinion, 5 has to be better sounding. This sounds like... And it handles so soon. What is this first person joke? This man changed his name again? This man loves wasting money. One of my old friends, first his name was SK Bai, and now he changed his name to That's Karma. This man loves wasting $10, I can tell. Oh, it does not like to turn like that. Now on the left. Taking my corners tight. Right behind the bends. Ooh. Okay, thank God that I known that I was gonna hit that Mercedes, but thank God I did not. I was about to, but then I'm like, something told me to sit down right there. Okay, Benino and Enzo. That's a rivalry on Drive Club, but the Benino's taking it by a long shot. In real life, the Benino will still kill the Enzo. Is it mid rear? Is it mid rear or? I know it's. I know there's four wheel drive. There's front rear drive, and then there's. Is it? I think it's mid rear drive. I'm not sure. Yeah, I gotta be. Okay, this F1 is faster shooting than Yeah, we had a... We had an old match. F1 versus 9-11. Ethan was detuned in his McLaren. I was in a stock and 500 course. Well, the transmission was tuned. I can't really say stock. But I was keeping up, but he was fast as shit. So I'm guessing when you set up a car for Blue Moon Bay, you can just go to any track and still dominate. Which is actually really impressive. Alright, we're on the F40. Nope, F1 will kill the F40. That's not a good match. It's 570 and a 650. Oh my god, okay. 570 and a 650? That could be a match, but in my opinion, I see the 650. I see the 650 is taking it. I don't know why I break. But yeah, in uh, 570 versus 650, in my opinion, I see the 650 as winning. Going past the M4. Even though that car got, that, even though that car is about to be too loud. So man, can you tell me the origin of your car? Origin of my I don't, I don't even own a car in real life. I'm 17. But I can't have my mom's car. <laughs> so that's saying something. Okay, this is a little crowded. 
two Germans are with two Lexus. They can't even get past. Well, the M4 is getting past, but that's crowded. Y'all see that? that? That's crowded. <laughs> that's crowded. Okay. I don't like this first person camera. Like, no, I do, but this is not how the F1 was set up. Not like this. It looks low. Like, it don't even look low. It looks higher. Wait, can I fix that actually? Wait, can I fix that actually? I don't see no difference. No, that's video. No. Uh. Okay, that's higher. That's lower. Front and back. Yeah, this is not good at all. <gasps> oh, that's how they. Oh, this is how people been driving. Okay. Oh, this looks better. What? I'm, I'm so late. I'm I'm way I'm way too late on this. Why did I not know about this camera? Now I can actually do better than before. This is how people. I don't know. If, I don't know if everybody has a setup like this, but I I seen people on the PS4 Pro have a setup like this. So now I know this camera angle is better. Like, look at this camera. Like, how do you not? How do y'all not like this? Like, this is actually a really good angle. I like it. That was a good slingshot pass. Even though they're leaving the Citroen behind again. I feel like the Citroen deserves more. Not that one, but there's one missing. If you guys played Grand Turismo 6, there was the concept version. It was like really fast on Route X. Pretty much like the wind. But this is like the wind needs to be an event for this game. But the way how I see it, no car is going to survive but the Veyron and the Wire. And maybe the LaFerrari and the Benino and the Volvo. It's pretty much going to be cars in the end category along with Giro ones But. This is how I see it. I say throw in GRX cars in as well, but if the Tomahawk X is a main rivalry, a main rival, it's over as an AI. Like that thing will just obliterate everything as a main rivalry. But if it's not a main rivalry, maybe the race, maybe both the race and the street version can have an advantage and take part because when you think about it the street version is not as fast the race version and the x version are pretty much fast i love this camera angle like you don't understand i love this angle but yeah tomahawk x has a main rivalry it'll be game over gr1s you're gonna probably see all the gr1s but these for light the wind, I want to see four courses. But I'd rather have Route X be last, but with two laps. For the first race, for light the wind on this game. First race, I can see. And I hit the four five. Oh my god, now we gotta do it again! I tried to slingshot pass again and it didn't work. These AIs are part of the shit. Don't know when to move out of the way. Yeah, first race, this one, but 30 laps each. Yeah, 30 laps each for this for, for this race. For like the win on this course. Uh, second lap, Lasarf, no chicane. Um, I could say maybe I don't know, maybe nine or ten laps, maybe nine or ten. I could see ten laps.
Yeah, I, I would say like nine or ten laps. So, Tokyo Expressway. I said Tokyo Expressway. What the fuck? Uh, Blue Moon Bay. The sorry. Oh yeah, Tokyo Expressway, but the East version. Like the long straight version? That could be 11. And Wu X could be the final. And if there was like two more updates, if they were to add to an addition to that, two new additions will probably be the two tracks that I see coming in probably with the like the win. I could probably see. Hell no, not Northern Isle Speedway. That. Every, all cars are gonna get demolished. Well, not all cars, but it'll be pretty much packed. And it'll probably be 50 laps, because that's like one of the easiest tracks in the game. You're just going around in a circle. I hit the 458, so it's most likely I'm gonna get a handicap. And now we gotta do it again. This is gonna take longer than I thought. But yeah, that'll actually be interesting to see like the win. In an old event that I remember, we're gonna take this back. We're gonna go way back to like Grand Turismo 3. Um, I want them to do those one-on-one -on -one rally car events. Like have the same rally cars go against each other. That'll be fun. But we need more rally tracks like, for example, um, I want Thaddy Maze. T-A- I think it's I think that's how you say it yeah I want that track back I want Smoky Mountain back I want Swiss Alps back especially that's the one track that I'm mostly seeing I think I'm saying Grand Turismo 6 if I'm not mistaken oh <laughs> never mind we don't gotta do it one more time I already have it I was about to say, thank God. Hang on. All right, so we did that three times. Now we're on to the GR2s. Now I know these, oh, fuck that track, that one's longer soon. I mean it's not that, who invited me? She really invited me back? I thought we're done. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Um. Oh shit, I forgot about this one. Um, but I'd rather do this one because this one is more an event of an event. But yeah, GR2s. I have all of them. These two I drift with, so don't worry about these. One, two, three, four, five, six is what I race with. But my favorite one is the Epson because I have the Takata Dome replica. If you guys know which one I'm talking about from Grand Turismo 4, driver mission number 37. Along with the Motor Pit with you. I know everything by heart. Listen to this. It sounds... See that? Oh my god, that sounds amazing. Wait, is it only GR2s now? Oh, it's GR3s. I was about to say, is it only GR2s? I was about to say. No way. Okay, anyway, so... We got a we got Lexus, Honda, Lexus, Honda, Nissan, Honda, Lexus, Lexus, Nissan, Honda, Lexus. All right, let's just get to it. Oh man, I love this camera. Yes, this is the cut. This is the Grand Tour Forte Cut Film Replica, and it fits on the Epson so well. Two times each for each race, trust me, we got all day. Thank
the cars can be maxed out. It, it don't matter. Damn, I feel bad, because this is not even fair. You're better in GR3s with GR2s, and GR2s are quicker than GR3s. Don't worry about what I'm doing. If I slip out, it's alright. But trust me, this is... This is so worth it right here. But yeah, um... This is not fair. GR2s and gr 3 GR2s will kill these things. Well, GR2s can't compete with GR1s when maxed out, because they actually have a chance. Not my fault. I don't care anything goes. I don't care. I do what I want. So two times each on this track as well. I don't really like that short... You see this? This track is even... This race is going to be in 15, min 15 or 20 minutes. I don't know why they, I don't know why they put that new track. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Well I fucked up. <laughs> okay. That happened. Looks like we're gonna finish the race in 25 minutes now. Because that happened. <laughs> And yeah, you can keep running this back as many times as you want. Trust me, I I'm not gonna get burnt out. Cause something, a, a little birdie told me that when it comes to these, when it comes to money grinding tips, never get burnt out of it. Cause you're still helping other people, even if new people are getting the game, which I know people are out there still doing. Oh, that thing's heavy. That that rape is heavy. Yeah, that rape is heavy. I'm just hitting cars. I don't care. But let me stop voicing around and just pass him. There's the motor on All right, now we're on to the, now we're on to the other. Yeah, sometimes I mess around. Yeah, you can do the same. Mess around and just knock AIs off. Watch this. Goodbye. <laughs> I don't care. I do what I want. Goodbye. What? Oh my god. That thing heavy. Now I'm about to just take that thing off the floor. Up. Oh. Never mind. Look, you don't have you guys don't have to do the things I'm doing. I'm just messing around with them. They take longer. But it's funny though. I'm not a bad driver, I just like to mess around. I'm pretty much both. A a good race car driver and a mess around. That Lux is almost trying to kill me. I don't I don't appreciate that. Get away. Get away. Get away. Get away. You see, look at if you look at the front and the back, it fits so well on this car. And I think it was in Grand I think it was in Grand Mall 4, but it's just not like this. Oh yeah, and I'm gonna take a screenshot and post it on Instagram today. I have all the Gran Turismo cases, including from the first one. Because I grew up on Gran Turismo over the years. I played the first one, I played the second one, I played the third one. I even played all the prologues, but in my opinion, like overall, favorite Gran Turismo of all time. This, Gran Turismo 6 is number 2. 5 is number 3. 
four is four, and three is five. Those are like the top five best players in the world for me. I know many people. Who, I know some people that grew up on Forza, and to this day, I don't know that many people that still play the first Forza or probably still play Motorsport Two or Motorsport Three or Four. And if you guys know the PS5 and the new Xbox Scorpio, I think that's what it's called, the Xbox Scorpio, if I'm not mistaken. Those are the newest ones coming. I don't know how I feel about it, but I do know they're going to be expensive as fuck. I'm still going to be on here, but if I, if I could try to stream on that, I might have a good chance. It's a Supra, a GR3 Supra. I'm gonna be nice. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I totally deserve that. What? What's that red car? What is that? Oh, I'm here for five eight. I'm just messing around. Okay. Bring that big red ass here. I swear the 4 5 bit is like one of the best GR3. I watch Hammer Studios from time to time. Why do you think my my main my main menu says like when you go to my menu and look? Hammer Studios fan. Because he's the main one that gives us the details about the updates and the leaks. There's still probably leaks going on out there. But we're still focusing on this update with the Red Bull, the Tundra, the CeeLo. I said CeeLo again. Wait, is it CeeLo? Yeah. The CeeLo, the Tundra, the Sports 800, the Red Bull, and there was another one. Oh God, what was the other one? The Red Bull, the 220 Oh yeah, and the Camaro Z28. Oh yeah, and about the X2019, before you buy it, if you have enough. It's not the same as the X29 as the X2014. It's heavy. Where would I read it? It's a 7.5. The 2014 is still a 9.5 because the 2014 actually handles better than the X2019. I'll probably show that at the end. Like it handles way better. It corners better, but the X2019 it, it corners decent, but it takes corners so slowly. I don't know why I keep looking back and my car is scratched. I might, I don't know, I want to buy me another Epson because I love the way it sounds. And the way it looks. And nobody was expecting old GR2s to compete with the newer one. But the way how I see it, the newer ones are actually stock wise. Okay, yes, yeah, stock wise, the GR2, the newer ones are quicker, but fully upgraded both. The old ones are actually decently quicker along with the newer ones. Like, I did a drag race with all of them in a straight line. The old ones won. And I'm using my gold controller, which I brought two weeks ago. It's really good. Like, no problem. I kept it clean, no scratches on it, no nothing. Like, this is the controller I'm gonna take care of. Because the blue one that, I don't know if you guys were watching my old stream, but the blue one that I was using on my birthday stream, which I did, uh, that was on the night. Mm. But yeah. 
It was a lot. You see, this is what I get for being Snapchat famous. I hit 1.7k views. And I'm doing streaks with everybody. Like, if I was that famous, I would do streaks with everybody in the world. All over the world. Even in China, even in France. So I would. Uh, sorry, Alexis, no hard feelings. Oops. <laughs> well, that happened. Don't do what I just did, I'm just messing around. But when it comes to but when it comes to competition, I don't play dirty. Like if you like watch, one day I'ma stream an online event. Like racing with other people, trust me, I would not play dirty. People may make it seem like I play dirty, but I really don't. I race. And I do time trials and I I don't know, should I start doing reviews? I, I'm not bad at reviews, but like, I can try. Oh look, it's the original, it's the original. Why are you with the Nissan? Go away. Right now I gotta spend you out I swear these cars are heavy as shit. Oh it shook me! It shook me! It shook me! Oh my fucking god! It juked me! Are you kidding me? I'm mad as shit. I'm mad at shit. It juked me. It just juked me. Are you fucking kidding me? No, I'm on that ass now. Fuck that. That car juked me. Uh-uh, you're not going home. And it didn't go on it. Alright, next. Alright, the second time we do it, I'm not messing around. I'm gonna just go. This is gonna take longer now than I thought it would be. Oh, look, it's an extra nozzle. I have a modal. I have a modal all tech livery. Like they have deliveries well detailed, but there's still a few errors in a few other deliveries that I found. Like. The yellow hat, like, the tires are, the one that I had downloaded, right, and it was by a mistake, I downloaded green, like, the delivery is perfect, but the tires were green. I'm like, this is not right, bro, bro. like, what are you doing? Oh, that's my brother. Hi, brother. Letting me, I don't know, pass. And we finished the race under 14 minutes. But yeah, you guys can do this race too, but don't don't do what I did. I was just fucking around. That was funny though. I tried to take some of them out and I failed. Alright, let's see here. Oh. Oh. The Evo got it in the back? Wow. 200,000. Level 49. Damn, I came a long way. Okay. 
Yeah, 200,000, also worth it. We're going again, but this time I'm using the XNR. And no horsing around, I'ma just go. And then once we finish all the money grinding tips, to keep you guys occupied, I'll show you guys the drag races and what went down. Alright, what GR3? It's probably the same GR3 cars, I think. Oh, no. Two Lexuses. Two Lexuses. That's that's a word? Two Lexuses. Okay. Okay, so we got the MO Frey race in 2016 and 12, and the 17s and 14. We got a Huracan, we got an M3, we got a Hyundai. Oh, it's pretty much Europeans. Okay. Oh, wait, no, it's not, because. These are Japanese. There's only two Japanese. I was about to say the rest were European, but never mind. Let's go. And yes, this is the Moto Attack look. It is actually what we do. Oh, you guys didn't know that car's in the crew too. Right behind me. Now they're just now they're just leaving them. That's funny. I swear. Yellow and white? That's actually not bad looking. How does that green one look to you guys? It doesn't look too bad, right? Now I'm behind the new... Now... Now, we're, now I'm right behind the... Hold on, what the hell? Damn these kids. Oh my god, yeah, I tried to break as soon as that thing just... Jesus Christ. Any scratches? Probably on the side. Probably on the side doors, but I'm not going to. Get over here, Lexus. Get over here. You may be quick stock, but I'm faster fully max out. Yeah, for, for the GR2 races, I highly recommend that you get your cars maxed out. Trust me. You're going to want to finish this quick. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's a green and black gray break. That's a green and black gray break. And it won't let me move. Yeah, that's good partnership. Thank you, Honda. I appreciate it. That's good partnership. That's really good partnership. Thank you. That's why you guys will never be Nissan in the future. Oh look! Great big side by side. Gotta break that feud. Is this one with a livery or one without? That's one with a livery, I can tell. And it's all black. 
Oh, it's a mobile one. Okay. For August or September's update, cause if you guys know me by senior year, in my senior year, I'm gonna have more fun because I'm gonna be out of school early. I get out at 12 on the dot, come straight home. Oh man, that's gonna be fun. But yeah, um, oh yeah, senior year. I'm gonna have more time on gaming and YouTube, hopefully. Hopefully, we're gonna get, it much home, get as much home. And I know in senior year is just looking up colleges. I don't know if I'm gonna go to college. But I know it's a lot, and I don't really feel like doing four or three years. I'll probably just do one or two. I can do that, but I don't know if I really want to. Now we're on the fourth lap now. Oh yeah, and when I... And then I'ma just... When some of these days I'll upload more but I'm not gonna be talking I'm gonna be attacking some of the courses in different category cars like for example like I've been watching Hammer Studios videos lately people have been attacking courses fast as shit in GRX's, GR2's, GR1's in categories and drifting yeah people drift I'm gonna be doing that too People be attacking courses at fast as shit at very high speed. I uploaded one too, but I haven't joined his community, which I need to do. Do I want to be in one of his videos? Maybe. I'm used to it. I'm used to it being me, peace, Ethan, restrained player. We had a group on here. It just Gran Turismo went to shit for that. Alright, I passed the Jaguar. And now the Hyundai is trying to pass the Alfa Romeo, but the Alfa Romeo is pulling away. Oh yeah, and compared this, compared to sounds. This one on here and Gran Turismo 6 sound side by side. The Gran Turismo 6 version is high pitched. This is like a this is a mix of a medium and low pitch. Like it's up there, but it's not like it's just not like up there by a long shot. If you get what I mean. Damn, that beater was just leaving that Lexus behind. Lexus, you have got to let me get past. Oh yeah, and for that vision race, um, you can use the tomahawk. You can use all three tomahawks, it don't matter. You can use those three to finish the race quicker, along with the chair on. Yes, the Bugatti chair on. I mean, I know it's a vision, but that's a chair on. Now, if we had the actual chair on, that thing would be, well, beating everything except the tomahawk. Let's just say that. But those three Tomahawks, the Chevron, the McLaren Ultimate Vision, and you could probably use the, um, that Rocket Chapra looking thing. The two times vision. Yeah. I mean, everybody says it looks like a Batmobile, but to me, it's more like a rocket car. And no, it's not like the Rocket Voltic in GTA, so I know what you guys are thinking. Cause I know deep down inside everybody's thinking about the rock and roll too. Pretty much it's a Lotus Elise, but it has a rocket engine in the back. It's fast though. Just as long as you don't use the rocket. I mean, I play GTA, yes. But I'm a bad sport till next month. That's why I deleted it. Cause when I get back out, it's over. I'm gonna body everybody in my way. I don't wanna hear no complaints. 
I don't want to hear no bullshit. I don't care if I get killed. Because I also have an RC and an orbital cannon that can just murder everybody in my way. People can consider me as a wannabe. I don't care what they think. I'm actually, I'm actually trying. I don't gotta have try hard outfits. I make them. But I do have one with a money bag, so that's a first. And that was like seven months ago. I got GTA 5 back around Christmas. I took it back in the summer, which was a dumb move. And then I took the Crew 1 back, and then I realized I don't need the Crew 1 on disc, because I had $10 on my account, like, thank God, I just re-downloaded the game. So I could just delete it right now, and then just re-download it again whenever I want to. I'm telling you, a lot of games I have, I can have fun with. Like, for example, what if I wanted to re-download Black Ops 3, I could just delete 2K, Drive Club, and Fortnite. Just to get Black Ops 3 back. But Black Ops 3 is dead. Nobody plays Black Ops 3 or Black Ops 4. Ever since Black Ops 4 came out, it's been a big hit. People still play to this day, but... After some time, like... You play that one game for all the time, it just starts to die. Like this game, for example. I still play, but I'm, I'm not dying off of it. I don't complain. I still have fun on it no matter what, and I'm gonna stop. What's going on up here? This is like the X and IV, and the Epson are having problems trying to pass that Jaguar. Oh, wait. No. That's not a Jaguar. It's like the Epsons got past my original replica. Just trying to pass the green one. Get over here, Grinch. Get over here, Grinch. Oh, yeah, and they have a re Amia. If you guys know the. I think that's what it's called, yeah. Re Amia or Re Amia. It's something like that. With the RX7, you know, the tuner version, but. That thing is ugly looking. On the Epson. They have a livery made for that. It's ugly as shit. I do not like that. That's why I said the replica for all of them, they're decently good. For our next update, I want to see... We need more... Yes, we need more GR2s. So that's a fact. And we, we need more touring cars. The Renault... Yeah, the Renault Megan GR4 Turing, the trophy version. That's a fir that's the first car to actually make it back here. We need the Audi A4 Turing car. Yeah, we need that back. We need the Opel Astra. We need that back. There's a lot of cars that we need back. And one of my favorite Le Mans cars. I want the Toyota GT1 back. I would drive that car non-stop in GR1. That's the only car I would race in non-stop. Or if it's the Minota or the Bentley Speed 8. One of the three. We need more GR1 cars. I mean, I know it's a lot of road cars, yes, and they're doing, they're doing, like right now I know the updates are coming in slowly, but they're doing, they're doing good. This update is more like an eight. The last update with the Kunta. No, wait, that was. I think the last update was the Kunta. I'm not sure. I gotta go back and check. And where's the rain at? Like, it's still being questionable. Where is rain? Like, I wanna race GR2s in the rain. I wanna drift in the rain. And we need snow tracks too, because I don't know why y'all have snow tires in it. This is the thing I don't get. They have snow tires in the game. Why do we not have a snow track? We don't have rain. We don't have snow. When are we all gonna... I'm gonna race some thunderstorms. On this game, that'll actually be real... That'll actually be realistic. That'll make the game more realistic if we race some thunderstorms. Thunderstorms, snowstorms, well, pretty much blizzards. That would be interesting to see a blizzard. Mm -hmm. 
Next thing you know, everybody's online. Literally everybody in the world is on this game. I'm like, oh my god, everybody's racing in the snow, everybody's racing in the rain. It's just amazing. It'll be amazing. And plus, Gran Turismo would be one of the first racing games to actually make it to the top. And be one of the first racing games in all over the world that everybody's gonna wanna buy, because even though this game is only 100 gigs. By 2029 or 2030, this game will be 200. It depends though if they put more gigs on it. Because every, every update is gonna be big as fuck. Well. Two wins, 254. We started at 220 with Blue Moon, and now we're already 30 minutes in, which is actually good. And we're actually keeping ahead of time. So we did Blue Moon Bay three times. So now we did the GR2 race. Now we're on to the vision. Oh, yeah, this is the one track that I got the most wins on, and that's because of the Tomahawk. You can do this like five or six times if you want. Or that, or this, or that, or that. Yeah, as you can see, now I have all of them. These are all the time I'm going to I live here, I made myself. Don't worry about that. Hmm. That's my drift version, so yeah. And yes, it is possible to start a tomahawk, and please don't ask how. All I can say is it's possible. Hang on, did she still invite me? Is she still in that party? Hang on, let me check. Oh yeah, she's still there. Alright guys, give me a minute. I'm gonna go talk to her. So she invited me on accident. <laughs> That's how she put it. <laughs> I don't know. So we got LM55. Oh my god, they do this every time. Why is there three pole jokes? And this car's a problem. I speak a little bit of English, but I speak French. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I, I respect that. I respect that. That's this is stupid. They have three pole jokes every time. But I'm gonna deal with it. Cause this this is how fast this race is gonna go. This is how fast this race is gonna go. Ten laps. This is like a good five minutes. Move. 
Oh my god, I actually handle this thing way better on this camera angle. This is wow. Yeah, I recommend that you use this time up. This time and surprisingly, which was I think the first time that they introduced this race, nobody was expecting this car to be. Nobody was expecting this car to be a main rival. Well, it's not a main rival, but it's you can use this car for this race. I don't want them to take this car out. They take this car out. I, I'm not doing this race. I mean, I'll still do the race, but probably with the racing version. Um, well, they, okay, there was an error in the other vision race in the amateur league. I said, I fucked up. Yeah, I messed that corner up, don't do what I did. Yeah, there was an error in the amateur vision race, so pretty much they removed the Audi GR1 vision from the race. And that car was so easy to handle. I'm gonna go back on that race again. Because that car was the only car that everybody pretty much won with. But I guess they realized that it was only a GR1 car. That's probably the reason why they removed it in the first place. That's probably the reason why they removed it in the first place. <laughs> that chair run is trying way too hard. And there goes the rocket car. I done it clean one. I done it clean once when I had that monster energy limit. when I had the monster energy livery for this car. That's the that's the only time when I actually done the race clean. Four flap coming in. Yeah, they got all three pole positions. I, I just don't get that. It's kind of stupid though when you think about it, because you have all three pole taking over fourth, fifth, and sixth place, which is giving the chair, which is giving the chair on and the chap rail two times vision uh, dis uh, an advantage to actually pass them and actually get up here and take over. This thing is taking 14,000 RPMs. Lord help me. This thing takes 14,000 RPMs. This is ridiculous. For a four-wheel drive car with 2,586 horsepower. Thank God this car is not real, because in real life, this thing... I don't know who would handle it. Not even me. I would not want to drive this thing in real life. In a straight line? I mean, I can handle a launch, but... In a straight line? Oh, oh no. Oh, no. You're gonna need a parachute in the back of this. If they could fit one. Oh, gosh.
Sorry, oh my gosh. That's not my fault. I'm just getting away with it now. I'm just getting away with it. Yeah, th this thing will push anything out of the way. Oh, wow. Come back. Go on a timeout corner. Okay, the Audi's got it, but the Mazda's gonna get it back. Oh my god! Ooh, that thing's an eighth. Yeah, let me stop playing around now. I gotta go. Yeah, we legit gotta go now. That thing's in. Oh, that thing moved to seven. Yeah, I'm going. I'm going. Why is there Zagato in this horse? Such to see a strange car in the race. Oh, I think I pushed the wrong. Up, I did it again. In a straight line, Tomahawk kills everything. He can even kill an Enzo at a 5.0 gear. I mean, I know the car is overpowered, but still. And I think the and I think the Chaparral is right behind the pole jokes now. Yep, it passed one. Up oh, now the pole jokes taking advantage. Up oh, now the Chaparral's got it, and that I, I just seen the pole jokes take that turn way too wide. Stupid idiot. Get out of the way. And the Chaparral lost his chance of trying to catch the blue one. Like I said, I mess around. When I play serious, I take it serious, but this is just messing around. But the second time, I don't play around. I just take it to Oh, God. Oh. Bye-bye. <laughs> I think it spun out again. Yup, it did. Which gave the Audi e-tron the one per second place. It's 3.08, we started this race at 2.52, and this is going on for like, I don't know, 15, no, not 15, it's gotta be like 17 or 18 minutes. This night. Sorry, Sagato, no hard feelings. I gotta pass that Mercedes before it crosses the line. No, I was too, I was like a second. See, a hundred fifty thousand at six hundred balance points. Now, why did I press replay? Damn, that was nine minutes. Stop pressing the replay button. Alright, now the second time, no horsing around. Three hundred and fifty-five wins on on this course.
looks like we got more time on our hands. But I'ma just be quiet the whole time so that you guys will see how this is all going on. Is it me or did they change the sound a bit? They changed the sound a bit on this. And it sounds different. Oh yeah, we're doing this on Red Bull Ring. Apparently Tokyo Expressway is way too long, so... Oh yeah, and that red version I bought from the PlayStation Store, but the black one I won. Because I realized that the color variation looks good in so many colors. I just wish you could make a livery for them, but unfortunately you cannot. Alright, we're on the second lap, 10 laps to go. Okay, too fast, too fast, too fast. That is too fast. Lord help me. Lord help me. Lord help me. Now the Red Bull race, we gotta cut the track. We have no other choice. We gotta cut the track for the Red Bull race. Ooh, okay, 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 oh my, okay, okay. I guess I gotta get past. Got two yellow ones in front of me. Get away, 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 get away. It's not much to talk about with that. I mean, it's not much to talk about with Mercedes F1 nowadays. But the first can view, the first person view looks cool.
pistols have eight gears. Yeah, it's one and two and three and four and five and six and seven and eight. There's like 20 cars in this race. I'm sorry, but y'all gotta let me get past. possible to slide in. That I'm not sure about. I mean you could try to get a good decent tool for the mistakes up on the trip, but I highly recommend that you don't go step on the power slide. They don't drift. They don't drift like how race cars do. But the way how race cars do, they don't drift. Like you gotta be kidding me. Wreckfest? The game Wreckfest? Don't worry about it. But yeah, the game Wreckfest is gonna be for pre-order soon. I'm thinking about it, because the game actually looks good. I'm thinking about getting it. I might, I might get the game, I don't know if I want it. I mean, I know it's gonna be more like a demolition derby type thing, but... It looks cool. But am I getting it?
I don't really have much to say about Mercedes F1. All I know is this this is the only event that I recommend you guys do. Yes, it may be 12 laps, but it's worth it. Don't worry about the spin out. I'm just focused right now because the way how I take my corner, that corner, I slipped out twice. I slipped out twice. Two times. I two times. I slipped twice. And yes, the stream may be long, but if you guys want to watch it and just skip some parts, go right ahead. I don't mind. But you guys will take me later. I recommend on the weekends or if you're not busy, do it two times each for each, for each event. And if you happen to own, well, I highly recommend you do buy a Mercedes F1. It's only two million. The Red Bulls are three million. Blue Moon Bay will help you get up there in like a good two hours. Or an hour and 30 minutes, to say the least. Now the GR1 race, any car goes, even a GR1 Vision. But I'm gonna play fair and use two different cars that I love since Gran Turismo 4. And it happened again. Yeah, we're gonna back down and use the official version. I mean, I said the official version, I'm in the official version. We're gonna back out and use the color variation version. And I, I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's happening. No, you don't. Oh my god. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening. Now I can't turn anymore. And it's gonna take longer. It's gonna take longer than I thought. Now. I think all the AIs have racing mediums on because I have racing swords. I'm not getting burnt out. I'm just. Yeah, I am. Getting but I'm gonna keep going though, cause I'm cause I'm cause, I, cause I'm helping anybody that I can in my way, especially newcomers that are coming to the game as well.
gonna be a lot longer. Like I said, it's gonna be a lot longer than I thought. Well, we're gonna take way longer now.
that race. Yeah, if y'all if y'all have time to do it, this race is long as shit. All right, two more races to go, and then we're done. Now we're on to the. I think we're on to the. Oh yeah, we're on to the GR ones now. I only done that six times, and I done the seven times. But. But yeah, this is GR one. Monza. Funnest race of all time. You can get that done. And like, let's see, come on. I would say like a good 11 minutes. But I'm using my favorite cars that I've driven since the previous location. And those two cars that I'm going to be using, 787B and the Sovereign Mercedes. But I'm starting with the Mazda first.
Okay, when it comes to when it comes down to LMTs and group ones, this is the event that I will always do. Hands down. But in my opinion, if they add more GI ones to Le Mans, we need the 24 hour Le Mans race. Like Lasarf and Nerver. But it has to be exactly 24 hours. We'll finish it in like, I don't know, two or three days. Just as long as it's on a Friday, on a school day. If I hit 13 or 14 million, I'll probably buy the Mural. No, I'm not getting burned down now, now that I'm still talking again. It's just that when it came to Formula 1's with the Mercedes, there's not that much to talk about. I beat Gran Turismo 4 five times. To this day, I still go on my PS2 every morning. I would get on like around 4 or 5 in the morning, play like a good 30 or an hour. And yes, I do have this car. I have all the cars in the game. Including the Lamborghini Diablo. And how do you win the Diablo? It's not just a glitch, but it's also a race that you gotta do. My favorite Le Mans car is the 787B. And also this car. And the R92. Ever since I've I played Gran Turismo 4 the first time. The R92 was like a car that I cannot stop looking at. Like it just looks so good. And it sounded so so good. Can you in real life the thing up close is like fucking really loud. Same as this car up close, also really loud. But hands down, let's be real here. Top 10 Le Mans cars in Gran Turismo. This is probably number one. The 787B, that's probably number two. The GT1, that's probably like three or four, because... It first came in the Grand Turismo. No, it was in Grand Turismo 2. All the Grand Turismo's hands down. I'm gonna keep saying hands down. We all know Grand Turismo 3. Out of all the Grand Turismo's, had the good graphics. Four also had really good graphics, but six. 100% great graphics overall.
one day, I will drive a Le Mans car. But in real life, I want to own an F50, and I, I'm still going to get that gold. I'm going to get that gold, and I'm going to try to get the 250 GTO. And I don't know where the hell they got 62 million from, because I know the real life price. It's probably like 20 or 15 million. They probably got that shit wrong. Alright, time for the final event, and yes, 2014 Red Bull event. Two times on this one, but we're gonna have to cut the track regardless. So let's go. Final event, you guys will take me later. Oh wait, before I end it, before we finish this, I'll show you guys what went down with the few of the drivers as well.
That was an epic fail. I trust you. I should have tuned my transmission down. I got to set all the way up to 280. Oh, yes. Surprisingly, I survived. By the way, this stream is about to be over. After this, I'll show you guys the drag races. Like I said, I hope all this helps. Do all of this. I don't know if I want to count in that Gran Turismo um, F1 race. Should we? Now nah, we just gonna stick with the six. But do the six races two times each if you really need them. I like how they're faster than me. That's probably why they're faster than me because I have my transmission up.
Well, there you guys have it, right there. That's a lot of work though. So now you know, two times each. One, two, three, four, five, and six. I'll probably do it three times, probably on Friday. But this time, before I end it, I'm gonna show you guys the drag races here. Or do you guys want to watch the whole thing to keep you guys occupied? We're gonna go down to the GR2's race. Starting with the Asanavi. I'm gonna mute my mic, so I'm gonna turn my mic on so that you guys will watch. And yeah, enjoy these drag races. Never mind, it's a whole lap around, but this car won.
Well, that was the Nissan race. Now we're on to the Honda race, which you guys will enjoy. I, you know what? I'll play all the drag races for you guys to keep you guys occupied. That's what friends do. Keep everybody occupied on the stream.
Wait, this is how I see 6 9 and oh, my numbers. Melometer, right? Are you dumb? Is that the dumb? Is that the dumb? Stupid!
But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to like, subscribe, comment down, and see you guys in the next one. And hopefully these tips helped. See you guys soon.